Good day, my friends. Good day, my friends. We are A to Z Investor, and my name is Romeo the Professor. I'm an investor, and we invest in crypto, forex, stocks, real estate. When you subscribe to this channel, you're going to get exclusive training, Bitcoin news, altcoin news, technical analysis, and forecasts for the best cryptos to buy based on the latest data. So my students and whoever's listening today, we're going to talk about the top 10 exchanges to look out for in 2021. Now, the top 10 exchanges change all the time. However, let's start with this. Uh, be be before I start, if you haven't subscribed to our YouTube channel, please subscribe to it. It's A to Z Investor, okay? So let's start with number 10. We're going to do it backwards. We're going to start with number 10. So, number 10 is Changely Exchange. It's going to start our list. We, it was founded in 2015, and it's offering over 150 cryptocurrencies uh, that you basically can buy, sell, and do movements like that. So, now, I'm going to click on here so you can see how the exchange look. To sign up to any exchange, you normally will need your driver's license and bank statement or... Uh, some statement that has your address on it or your passport. So you would just simply click sign up and then you would sign up. This is Changely, okay? So this makes our top 10, which I'll tell you at the end which three that I like and prefer the best. Um, Changely, I don't use them. It's not that I don't like them, it's just I don't use them. And then we have crypto.com. Now, the funny thing about crypto.com, now, it, it has since undergone a rebrand from Monaco to crypto dot com where it paid 12 million for the domain the, the, the domain name now that it operates so and not only that they do have a credit card that they offer too crypto.com now oversees roughly about 284 million in a daily volume and offers mobile application for ios and android android so crypto.com is making a, a, a huge movement in this space now now we do have the newcomer storm game uh that's number eight. Uh, the reason I like Storm, Storm, Storm Gain, even though I don't trade it now, is because uh, it's currently over 100 countries, and that's very important. I happen to be based in the United States, so we don't have problems like defining an exchange, but some countries have problems finding an exchange that will service them, where Storm Gain is over 100 countries. So it's, 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 it's a good one also. And they allow you to use credit card and bank transfers which is awesome now we have eToro number seven eToro is making a move now eToro before was known for social trading and multi-assets brokerage eToro has entered the cryptocurrency space now which is amazing and their exchange is eToro X so let me click on the eToro X so that you can see remember I said all of the exchanges you'll just click sign up here and then they'll ask you your basic information if it's an individual you'll click on individual full name email address and and then you'll put click here uh, trading and then you will submit now and basically you'll fill out the full information that's how all of these exchanges work okay now let's go back so eToro uh, it offers professional crypto services for corporate and institutional grade crypto traders. The popular exchange is currently doing about 467 million in daily volume. So that's one. Now, I currently don't use each Toro. Not that it's bad, but I have a saying that you always want to have at least three exchanges you use because um, some exchanges doesn't carry the coin that you would like to buy or trade so you always have to have three so we'll i'll tell you the three that i have but now remember i am not a financial advisor um i have to let you know that this is not meant to be considered as investment advice this is just what we do okay now bitrix i do have the bitrix account uh as with it is the investor i do have Bit bitrix account some of the other uh uh, instructors have different, but I do have Bitrix. Bitrix is one of the oldest cryptocurrency exchanges, so it's well known. And uh, Bitrix, for instance, uh, has approximately 315 different coins to trade. That's why I like it on the global exchange. And Bitrix is also available on iOS and Android on your phone. Okay, so if we click Bitrix, it'll be similar to like the other exchanges. 
you'll see on the top right hand side have sign up and and you'll see so if you want if you want to see the if you want to see the markets you can click here you'll see you'll see the markets right here and and then you'll see all the trading markets that everything you can uh, buy the different coins you got BTC Ethereum Cardano you have um, Teeter, you have Dajibai, XLM, Litecoin. So Bitrix is amazing. I have this exchange, okay? And, and it makes the top six of my chain exchange list. So now as we go down, we have FTX. It's a new exchange on the market, but <laughs> like they say, don't be fooled. It's doing about $7 billion in daily trading. And it is a strong exchange. I do not have this exchange. That doesn't mean I do. I would not recommend it. It's just remember, I told you, I prefer only having three. And once you have three, unless one of those three does not give me what I want, I'll find another. And so these are the top ten of the find another that I would do. You know. And the beautiful thing about FTX is currently offers derivative spots, prediction validity, and even recently added stock markets to the exchange. The exchange also features an over-the-counter for whales who needs the fast settlement. Okay. Now, if you're based in the United States, you sh you most likely will know Coinbase because Coinbase is huge in the United States. It happens to fall number four. Okay. It was founded in 2012 and it is one of the oldest exchanges. I do have Coinbase. So let me click on it because I do have a lot of United States viewers that's listening to this. So here Coinbase, as you can see, you see my name in my dashboard. So Coinbase is, is, is amazing too. However, some of the pairs, uh, some of the currencies that you want to trade will not be here. Uh, let me, let me, let me go back out to portfolio. So some of the coins that you want to trade will not be here. So we look at, at portfolio. Uh, as you can see, you see I trade a lot of current pairs. Okay, so that's Coinbase. Okay, and so let's back out now. Now, Coinbase has over 43 million verified users in 100 countries, and that's amazing. And they do about 5.7 billion in value. However, they only have 44 cryptocurrencies on the exchange. So that's why I say you want like to have about three different exchanges you use. Therefore, if you want to uh, trade another or, or invest in another cryptocurrency, you can. Now, Sushi Swap is one of the newest and latest. It is amazing. It is a decentralized exchange. And it makes the list as one of the popular exchanges. I would keep an eye on it for 2021 because it does 446 million in daily volume. The exchange has grown in popularity as users seek to move off centralized exchanges. All of the exchanges I told you before were centralized. Uniswap is not. And it offers staking of crypto assets. So let's click Uniswap right here. Let's read about Uniswap, a little history about it. It, it rised up tremendously fast. Um, if we click to understand Uniswap, let's go all the way down here. Where is it? Uh, there was something I wanted to click to show you on Uniswap. Uh, let me see. Okay, so I want to click on on something for you for Uniswap, but I'll quickly show you. So mm, I was going to take it to the Uniswap site itself. I was going to take it to the Uniswap site itself. I'm I'm sorry. Uh, not Uniswap. Sushi swaps. I apologize. Okay. Sushi Swap is the number third. I'll take you to Uniswap. Sorry, but, but let's just Sushi Swap. Sushi Swap is similar to Uniswap. I apologize, people. Second, I do have Binance. I love Binance, okay? The reason I love Binance is because realistically, Binance is the number one, but because it's not a decentralized um, exchange, that's why it's number two. But Binance is one of the biggest. It does 27 billion daily volume. No other exchange is even coming close to that volume. So Binance is one that I do have. And not only that, they offer over 275 cryptocurrencies to trade. I mean, it's the largest cryptocurrency exchange, period. And 
And if you click on Binance, similar, you buy, they have a Binance USA. You would log on here and you would create your account. And like I said, Binance offers all, all so many different coins. I mean, you got, I mean, like they just have so many different coins. Like, look at all of these coins. Uh, all these coins, all these coins, all these coins, like they offer so many. That's why I do carry Binance. Um, if you're in US, you have to do the Binance US. Okay, now the number one which I want to take is Uniswap now because it's decentralized and Uniswap is doing amazing numbers. Uniswap has seen some of the fastest growth of the platform and it's doing about 1.2 billion daily. Okay, now. Uniswap is looking to improve its current offering by offering lower, faster settlement and cheaper transactions. Now, so let's click on Uniswap so that you can see what's currently going here. Okay, so let's click. Let's see what happens if I click here. So, yes, Uniswap right here. If you want to start trading, you click here and make sure you're on, on uh, the actual Uniswap uh, exchange because there's a lot of copycats. And, this is the beautiful thing right here. Now, um, I do have a um, uh, video and that I'm going to do on Uniswap that I did previously so that you can understand how to do Uniswap because it's a decentralized exchange, but that meets the top three. So, if I was to go, one second, if I was to go, apologize. To my top three, I would say uh, Uniswap would be my third, my fourth, my fourth that I like. Binance would be my second. Coinbase would be my uh, first, and I like Bitrix. So, uh, so those are the four that I like: Bitrix, Coinbase, Uniswap, and Binance. But remember, I'm in the United States where you would probably like uh, a difference. So, again, these are the top 10 exchanges and decentralized exchanges that we like. Okay? I am Romeo, the professor with It Is The Investor. If you haven't subscribed to our channel, subscribe to our channel now where we share with you the latest topics. Okay? I am Romeo, the professor. I'm out.